वेलकम बैक गैस टू ऑरेंज एक्स एंड ऑल वी आर लेफ्ट टू डू विथ इन दिस ऑसम वेदर ऐप इज टू हैव समथिंग सच दैट वी कैन अपडेट द नंबर ऑफ सीट नंबर ऑफ डेज काउंट सो करेंटली ऑल द फंक्शनिटी वी आर हैविंग इज दैट वी कैन पुट इन एनी सिटी अकॉर्डिंग टू आर कन्वीनियंस एंड विल वी कैन जस्ट फेस द डेटा फॉर दैट सिटी सो यर वी सी दैट इज इट इज़ नॉट न्यूयॉर्क एंड इफ वी टाइप समथिंग लाइक कैलिफोर्निया and do the search we will see that this thing is getting updated but we are just fixed to the number of days of forecast to 5 so next ahead we'll go and do that so this is actually very easily can be very easily achieved with something like paper slider because we can actually have something like put in the data put in the number of days manually but then it won't look that cool so what i have decided that we will be using paper sliders and we'll be using something like this and where you can just update the value with a slider okay so this slider is actually very easy easy to achieve all we have to do is that first we have to go into the project and then we have to go to the elements file and in the elements file we have to put in paper slider okay and here here we will just update this thing next we'll quickly go into the file where we want to slide uh, where we want the slider to be placed and we'll just scroll above and okay so we want the sl slider to be just below this input bar and above the city name so i'll just put in a paper slider okay and the paper slider takes in few properties first we i'll give it an id of like paper slider and i just give this uh, like value okay so the value is actually the starting value and then i'll put in a max so it will have the maximum value of like 10 days and then i'll give it a step of of like 1 so the step actually means guys that when we move this slider this will actually go up to 1 and if if the step is like 2 so each time we move, move the slider it will go by two points like after zero it will just skip to two and then four and then six okay so that actually what means the step part over here and then i'll put in a snap okay snaps is actually that we have this functionality of auto snapping so it will not move to something like 2.5 or something like that it will just snap it and now all we have to do is this have this a pin okay let's see what happens okay so basically there is nothing showing up so snaps pin let's check the console Okay, so the console is giving me an error that paper slider dot classes dot html is actually not present. So I'll just go ahead and check this again. I'll just update this thing. Paper slider. Okay. Dot html. Okay. So that's why we should never do a copy paste. And now I'll just go ahead and refresh. guys so now we have this awesome paper slider and all we are and now we have this functionality to kind of put in any city name and we have the slider which actually shows the number of days so you can maybe put it to 7 or like 0 or 3 or anything you want up to 10 or you can just change it anything like i just put in here 20 okay so in the next tutorial guys we'll just go ahead in the javascript part and connect the two things that is the slider along with this count property out here and then we'll auto update the city accordingly so stay uh, definitely watch the next tutorial guys and keep subscribing and keep liking the videos and please put your comments in the discussion forum below and thank you